to. What's She's that mean, Mel? Rotten whore bank. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Honk your horn so there she knows where we are. When it's her. Oh God! Oh God! Oh, Eugene, you hit her! Oh, you hit her! You just oh, ran over! Oh, there she oh, is. Oh, is that a skunk? Oh God! Oh God! I think oh, I hit Kiki, somebody. are you all right? Part of my spleen. Part of my spleen came out. Part of my spleen. Oh, Eugene, she is in front of the damn car, Eugene. Oh God! Oh. <laughs> I can't draw. I'm sorry. <laughs> Where is she? I never see her. Eugene, she's in front of you. Do whatever you do, Eugene. Do not go forward. All right. Go forward. No, do not go forward. I said. Hey, no, 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 no. I'm trying to Okay. Are you? Are you? Okay. You're all right. Okay, man. Oh my god. No, it's not that bad. Uh, no. It's not He's not okay. It's not as bad as it looks. I think it's probably as bad as it looks, Mr. What the fuck? What it's happened? It's just a bit of road rash. We all need to gather it's by the road rash. $50 from all out, happy five year, man. Would. Thanks for all the laughs and uh, being a major inspiration. Hey, happy to be your outlaw. Uh, Ma'am, you missed her Ma on the you bed. You missed the bed? Wait. Where'd she go? You just threw her into. What happened? Did you just oh my god, is this like Harry Potter? I've seen this. Platform 73 quarters. Here I come. All right. What a run. He's a wizard. He'll kill you in your sleep. Oh, that didn't work, ma'am. She's not. She's not in the incinerator, Mel. She's not. Are you sure? Oh, where did she go? Okay. okay. Blow it up. <laughs> Eugene, what do you. Oh, Eugene, Damn. have some respect, man. God. All right, I'm cleaning up the one on your leg. A little bit of a sting. You're here. talking I'm about. I'm just gonna do the same kind of stitches. All right, that's my bad, you know. It's just. Who's looking? There was a bug on her shoe. My bad. All right, all right. I'm gonna put. I... Kiki, yeah, Dale has what? a strong <laughs> gravitational pull around him. I can't uh, help okay, him Eugene. Him there's no need for that now. All right. Uh, well, Listen. I can't have your gravitational pull as strong. I Man, my wife is gonna be pissed. You can't say like that to someone well. just because he's the size of the moon, okay? Whatever, Kiki. You're hard to look at. It's a bit on the statement. The hey, moon that has a weak gravity fucking... comparison. I'm not gonna hit you. I was never told to hit a woman. Ma'am, in the white shine. That's what a woman, Dale. So feel free. Man, you think she got Don't you, bro? Me. She got fucked. Put on the side. Uh oh. Look at this is working. I know what you're thinking, and I'd like Here to advise go. you no. to do oh. it. Absolutely do oh. it. Do oh. it. Oh. 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 Well, that was working for a minute. Uh, go get her, Eugene. Um, where is she? I She's think standing she... on the car for me. Oh, she, I'm pretty sure she oh, fell no. all the way down. Ah. Oh, she's all right. Congrats on the five years. Hope a long time. Also, when you just say congrats to the revolves, it was congrats on the five years. Up the stairs, despite being incapacitated. You're fine. Well, what the? Eugene, you just picked her up from that far away. What? No, you're a little I scuffy sausage, too. I think we're all scuffed. Ah! Oh, no, I can oh! still get my. I can <laughs> still get back to my combo. Eugene, I'm you just I'm threw fine. her off the. Oh my god! I can't see! You I can't see her! her. She's I can't dead. see her! She's standing She's there down there! You just. Undertaker, can I have your autograph? Look, I can pick her up again from up here. No, Watch you can't. Do There's Don't no way. It. Oh, my God. He's a wizard. He's a demon. I didn't know Eugene's a demon. He's been in 87 world wars, and he's a demon. I figured it out. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help Please help. Doctor. Oh my god. Doctor. He's perfect move, perfect. Help. Doctor, please. he's a demon. Please. Please. Uh, it it right yeah, no, you You don't look so good, Dale. It's okay. That's fine. No, he's alright. What's wrong? <laughs> No, he's fine. What's wrong with me? Nothing, nothing. You're fine. Just his gravitational pull absorbing the bench.
No, okay. that's Jesus Christ. You're fine. Well, yeah, Gene, that is incredibly you're rude. Fine. <laughs> you're fine. Dale. Am I you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're You are slowly becoming one with the bench and the floor, but that's fine. If you angle it properly, you look very miniature. As long as, you as, long as you're happy, you day, as long as everything person. looks fine in your eyes. What's yeah, that's all that matters. As long as you're okay with Dale, what's happening. As long as you're having a nice time, that's all, all right. that matters, all right? He who who he is your side like of witness horrible. for your side there? Have you, ever seen, ben ben. have you ever seen Jumanji, <laughs> you know, where they start to slip through the floor I, and then it I'm sorry, I, I didn't hear what you said, Your Honor. What, what uh, I'm, waiting on your, I'm waiting on your other witness, sir, in Miss Dupont. Or any involvement that you may have had in that incident, sir. And I will remind you now that you are under oath, Eugene. All right. Well... I was at the apartments in my taxi cab with some of my friendsies, and I saw Kimball behind me, so I reversed up, and he was talking about going to the bank, as he said, to go get some money out across the road. Uh, and then someone uh, threw a frisbee into the middle, and then that reminded me of the time I invented the frisbee. So I started explaining how I would throw it to Edna, no. she would throw it back no. to me, and then I would throw it no. to Edna, and then she would no. throw it back to Kiki. me, and then Kiki. I would... Do not in my courtroom, Kiki. And then I would throw it back to her, and then she would return it back to me. And then I would return it back to her, and she would throw it back to me. And then, of course, Billy would join in, my grandson. And I would throw it to Billy, who would throw it to Edna, who would return it back to me. But anyway, I'm getting lost right now. I'm getting a little bit confused. Yes, so, Jean, um, could you please stick to the facts here? Yes, of course, that is part of the facts. But yes, um, so DuPont and was standing very close to Kindle. And Kindle was also standing very close to her. And they start, they were talking and nattering away as the millennials do these days when Kimball tripped over, it looked like his shoelace or something. He tripped over himself, fumbled like the bloody fool he is, and he, he stumbled into her. At which point she started proclaiming, help me, you attacked me. And we all thought it was a bit ridiculous, to be honest, because poor Kimball, we all know he's got jelly legs and he fell over. And it was as simple as that, to be honest. And then that was about that. Anyways, Dale, I went on this date. How'd the date go? Yeah. He, he took me to um, he took me to a, this Italian restaurant called Porta La Fuchsia, and he bought me a okay. seventy-five. Oh, no, John 70, Cena. No, no, not not John. He took me to a, a he bought me a seventy-five. Bam, bam, no, bam, no. Bam, bam, no. Bam, 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 bam. Why are you? Why are you crying? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay, hold on, hold on. I have, I know the solution. I know the solution. I'm just gonna put these two here together. Yeah, just do it. Leave Times. <laughs> Lizzie, you just need to cut me loose. This all goes away. <laughs> I didn't see anything. Okay. Uh, you alright, sir? Are you okay, sir? No, I'm nervous. My f usually there's guy with me here, Why? but he's not here today, so 
my first time taking oh, over. Oh, the... I see, I see. Are you are you under the influence of anything, sir? No, just weed. Just weed. So you come into the court of law under the influence public intoxication huh okay. well no it's not I'm not smoking in public it doesn't matter sir if you're out in public and you're intoxicated or there's a guy the, behind you know, your goddamn court control, case do not what? use that language well like English in okay my courtroom. <laughs> You can leave, sir. Next right. time you want to bring a camera in my courtroom, you Bye, ask. guys. Have a nice day. Thank you. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Is that a. Can you tell me a story? Tell you a story? Okay. Once upon a time, there was a pothead, and his name was Gob. And, um,. He got hurt a lot, and his doctor got very frustrated because the poor man was clearly not in his right mind uh, and played in traffic. So one day, Mr. Gobb, he got hit by a semi-truck, broke both of his legs, and spent the rest of his life as a paraplegic. The end. B -b -b Bog is depressed. Oh, you wanted a happy story? Yes. Hmm. Okay. Well, uh, in the in the uh, in the epilogue, <laughs> uh, Gob uh, lost both of his uh, oh. both of his arms to a black market organ stealer, and uh, lived his life as a chicken nugget. It's okay. And uh, maybe I'll he, finally he very... be a happy meal. <laughs> there you go. Happy story. Oh, I can't see. <laughs> Ron Otterman, live on the scene at the Vanilla Unicorn, where the strippers and female dancers working in the institution have uh, decided to go on strike. They've been forced to fight against each other to the death for men's entertainment, and they said no more. We've got at least one deflated breast and Oosh. many more on the way. And it looks like it's going to be a cold knockout. She's back up. Let's, uh, Boo, keep filming this. Keep filming this. And a right hook from Vanessa right into Britney's <laughs> face. That's going to mess up her Botox. And another right hook from Britney. Vanessa returning fire with a left jab. And a dodge. She goes right up to Ooh. her. And another Ooh. one. And that's going to be a three-punch combo. Oh. She's still standing. Oh, Four shit. and five oh, right in the God. uterus. Oh. Right in the goddamn oh, uterus. Oh. Jesus Christ. And it's not oh, stopping anytime soon. It looks like the amount of drugs these women have been forced to take are, are dumbing the pain. These women have been trained since birth to fight to the death, and it definitely shows. Oh, and it looks like oh, Vanessa is going to get knocked out cold. That's boom, get this ass. on camera. Oh, get this angle. What the fuck, man? Get that angle, boo. Get that angle, boo. All right. Uh, Ma'am, let me get an interview here. Boo, you're not. You got to film it. Get it. Get it all on film. All right. I got it. Ron Otterman here with the winner of the uh, the stripper battle royale that just occurred down at the Vanilla Unicorn. Uh, this woman over here knocked out cold. Uh, was she a victim? Most likely, after many, many uh, things we've uncovered in the back, these women being forced to fight for men's entertainment, apparently taking off their clothes, is not nearly enough. Men want more violence and carnage. Ma'am, you're sporting two black eyes, but you are the victor. What do you have to say for yourself? Uh, boss, I, uh, I, I, I applaud me, you uh... on your victory, but I, I, I have to say that it looks like Everybody's the victim here, and honestly, no one is uh, really coming out on top. Will they even reward you for this? Will they allow you to finally take a lunch break? And are they forcing you to do this under the guise that you'll be bitten to death by a venomous rattlesnake? And not a word from the champion, as she has been clearly forced into silence, as we've uncovered briefly uh, earlier tonight. She's not even allowed to speak. She uh, she's she's forced by silence, and uh, apparently will continue fighting. Uh, come down to the Vanilla Unicorn next week while she defends her title. She's now three weeks in the running. Uh, she's, she's the three-week victor. Will she go for four, defending her title next week? Come down and see Brittany at the Vanilla Unicorn. Rod Ottoman signing out.
Yeah, yeah, I know you, 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 you bet your ass you couldn't afford the wine, you little poor bitch. Get the fuck out of here. Enjoy the rain, asshole. <laughs> Are you coming back? You got something to say? What's up? How's it feeling being me? What? Oh my god! Oh! I didn't mean it, Joe. I didn't mean I. Hey, come here. Come here. Oh! Right. <laughs> oh my god! I didn't. Joe, I didn't mean it. Let me see, let me see. Are you one rank harder than me, bitch? You got the out there? Don't you be rank two? I thought you were rank three, man. Yeah, I got, uh, I got demoted because I, I think, Joe, again, Joe's drunk in Italy. He's trying to figure this out. But, hey, I'll be uh, promoted in a bit. Again, uh, just don't question my authority. Sounds to me like you already dropped the ball here. I'm, you hey, th dude, it's my, yeah. hey, listen, it's my first day on the job. I'm trying to be fucking intimidating. Can you just rock with it? I got another interview over here. I don't need you making me look like a bitch. Help me out for a second. All right, 90-10% okay. split, you have deal. I suck your boss, but then you good boss. 90-10, hmm? are you fucking kidding me? You're gonna negotiate the best deal in the business already? God damn, I love you. Okay, deal, 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 deal. Two on, Buck. Hey, buddy. <sighs> all right, so. What's up? Uh, this is my boss man here, man. He's good boss, all right? Don't do fucking nip to me. Fuck, cut your boss in half. He's very scary. I go to work, boss. To work now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. see? Work, yeah, see, he's working hard as shit, and he's uh, out there to collect some grapes. So, Buck, tell me about your last job. Why you uh, Why you coming up here now? Just finished the shift. Oh, well, very you're... good shift. You want to smoke? No, 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 no. Hey, you want to smoke weed on the job? That's cool. I don't mind. See, I'm laid back, Buck. I'm a chill boss. We're going to have a good time together, right? <laughs> yeah. We'll get out here. We'll collect some boxes. Uh, after the refinery and all that jazz, you can have two jobs. Like, that's cool. As long as, you know, you prioritize this job, Bog. Will you prioritize this job? Kevin? Yeah. You're scaring me, Kevin. We used to hang out and smoke weed, but... God damn it. I'm trying it's to... Bog, I'm trying to be... He's changed, man! He's changed, man! He's changed, man! He's changed, man! He's different. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, well, he even wearing the same job, shirt man. as the other guy I saw who acted scary. I think you've been hanging out with the wrong guys. You used to be this nicest guy who would never hurt anybody or hurt feelings even because it's too scary for you. But now it's, I feel like you're the kind of guy who would slaughter the composition. The comp is what the head off. I would not, I would, my, I would never do something. I just told you you could smoke weed on the job. What are you talking about? I'm a cool boss. T tell him, Link. Tell him I'm a cool boss. He's a cool boss, man. He totally didn't change, man. He totally was a big, softy, pussy, good guy when I first met him. Now he's a piece of shit. Remind me like John. Oh, uh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. Well, hey, 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 hey. There it goes. 80 20 split. Both of you. How's that sound? Does it sound good? How's that sound? Sure, man. All right. All right, not a problem, sir. Well, uh, I'll go ahead and take care of it. Uh, All right. You have a safe day, Mr. Um, how to say, how to, wait, say your last name. Kevin, Kevin Whippaloo, officer, Whippaloo. Fucking millennials. What the? Fucking cops. Jesus. All right, well. Uh-huh. Okay, you're going to hopefully try. How many go in? Bug! You're okay. Bug! You're okay. Bug! Ah! Wait, whoa. Is it... Are you okay? Are you okay? Jesus. Yeah, that was just. That was terrifying, right. Bog. I don't know what the fuck happened to me. What's up, man? Right. You here okay, for the Tylenol? Yep, we can. Yep. You sound like a Boston man. My friend. Uh, nah, man, not from Boston, bro. I'm California raised. Oh, that's very nice, yeah. Yeah, where are you from, brother? I'm from Libasol. Oh, drugs, shit. Cause... Okay. Yeah, that's true. All right. Never heard of that place. 
Sounds Salute like there's a doctor right, back here. Doctor, we need some assistance. I'm not sure what happened. But this motherfucker I'm is coming. in trouble. Uh -huh. Thank you, Doc. Right, go ahead and uh, put him down over here. You're welcome, Rami. You take okay. care. All right. I'll be right back, Charles. All right, Rami. There you go, brother. You're going to be... Oh, God. Oh, goodness. Uh, oh. Listen. God. Oh, uh, you've lost uh, a lot of blood, sir. <laughs> he did a cartwheel. Did you see oh, that? Jesus. Holy sh... That was my fault. I'm a little stronger um, than I thought. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, uh he... do you yeah, I'm not seeing him right now. Uh back mm, here. Nope. That's a that's a problem. I... Let me look out front real quick. That is a very big well, it just happened to Kiki, so maybe I think he might end up. Okay. Like, you got a spider on your foot, Doc, here. just to let you know. Might want to grab it. There you go. Fucking fuck. Uh, they're all everywhere, right, I um... know. Yo, Charles, yeah, let's go. Yeah, exactly. They, they oh, let me manage for a quick minute, all right? I have to, uh, you know, Yo, hold on. This guy mind. just did a cartwheel into the fucking other dimension. We got to find out where he went.